Hello everyone, it's Jonathan here, founder of Driving Academy, and today I'm going to give you the loophole on how to easily remove an automatic restriction. That's right, it's a loophole, it's a secret, don't tell everybody about this because then everyone's going to do it. But if you have a CDL license currently and you have an automatic restriction on your license, which means you cannot drive any manual transmission vehicles and you want to get that off of your license, I'm going to tell you exactly how to do so in this video right here. So there's going to be a few different steps, but the first step that you have to understand is here at Driving Academy, we're the best truck driving school in the entire country, and we can help you out through this entire process, no matter what part of the country you live in. So if you do need help to remove this restriction off your license, give our team a call at 908-525-3609 so we could definitely help you out. So let's get down to the steps. Step number one, you're first going to have to purchase a permit. You're going to say, John, why do I need a permit? I already have my license. Well, in order to actually take a test, you're going to need to get yourself a permit. The permit's not going to cost you the same amount of money that it cost you when you first got it, simply because you just want to remove the restriction. So you make an appointment at your local DMV, you go bring in your six points of ID with you, bring in your license, bring in some money and tell them that, hey, I just want to get a permit so I can remove my automatic restriction on the license. Step number two, learn how to drive stick shift. So in, when you're actually driving stick shift, it's super important that you get trained properly. So driving stick shift in a truck is completely different than driving stick shift in a car, especially if you're going into those 10 speed and higher type of gears. The most common transmission out there is an actual 10 speed. So if you find a school that trains you on a 10 speed, then they, it's actually going to be the best fit for you. Here at Driving Academy, we have our state of the art driving simulators around where we actually put you on our simulators first to make sure that you understand how to shift correctly and understand the patterns before we put you on the real truck on the real road itself. And that makes a very smooth transition process and helps us teach you on how to make it as simple as possible for you to actually learn how to drive stick shift. One of the biggest differences, you're going to have to do what they call double clutching. So that means you're in gear, you're going to clutch into neutral, and then you're going to come off the clutch and clutch back into gear. And I know it's going to be a lot of dancing work. So if you're a good dancer, it's going to be a piece of cake. However, if you're stuck in your car mentality of shifting, this might be a little bit harder for you to learn just as an FYI. So after you get your permit and you feel pretty trained, now you have to take the road test. Now you might be thinking, John, do I have to take that whole road test all over again? The whole two and a half hours, the pre-trip, the parking in the road? I'm going to tell you no. And this is where the loophole comes in. So the cool thing about this is all you have to do is take the third part of the test, which is the road portion of the test. And the loophole is you don't even have to take it in a tractor trailer. You can actually take it in a class B vehicle, or if you take it at our testing site, you can take it in a bobtail. Bobtail is something that, like this, and all that is means it's a tractor with no trailer. So that means you don't have to worry about taking your turns extra wide or hitting any curbs or making the test harder than it has to be. All we're doing is testing your ability on shifting. So that means you can drive, if you could drive a car, you can drive a bobtail, it's just a little bit bigger, right? And now you can actually uh, drive and just focus on the shifting and focus on making sure that you go through it without grinding or anything like that. Now, if you do grind during the test and once or twice, it's no big deal. Uh, however, things that will fail you automatically are gonna be if you stall the vehicle, that's gonna be an automatic fail. And the other big thing is if you coast the vehicle, the length of the vehicle itself. So it's about 25 to 45 feet, depending on the bobtail that you go on. So if you coast, which means you can't find the gear, or you put your foot on the clutch for too long and you're just coasting, not in gear, then that can be an automatic fail on the test itself. So you wanna make sure that you are making sure that you fully understand how to upshift, how to downshift, how to make your turns properly, and understand that it's nothing like driving a car. So if you like this loophole, make sure you like this button, make sure you subscribe to our channel. We're always putting out great new content here. And if you do want to actually go and get your CDL license fully removed from that restriction, give our team a call, 908-525-3609. We have our own training site here in Linden, New Jersey, and we are a certified testing site as well in our Pennsylvania location. And that means that we can actually train you and give you the CDL road test. Once you pass the test with us, then you go back to your local DMV to pick up your local CDL license. So even if you're from Alaska, California, Jersey, Pennsylvania, doesn't matter, we can test you and we can train you no matter what. So if you're interested, give our team a call at 908-525-3609. Again, that's 908-525-3609. Or check out our website at cdldrivingacademy.com. Again, that's cdldrivingacademy.com. Thanks and have a great day. Hey, thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, make sure you hit that like button. Also, subscribe to our channel. It's really gonna help us out. Click on that button. And if you wanna continue yourself on your road to freedom, here's more videos to watch. There's endless amounts. Hopefully we get to see each other one day very soon. Thanks.